Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. Learn how to lower the CPU temperature. So if your laptop or a desktop getting heated while playing games or doing video editing or anything, your CPU temperature, it's get, it gets heated, then this tutorial is for you. Now we will be doing some genuine steps to fix this problem and there will not be a magic tutorial. It will be a genuine way to fix the heat problem of your laptop. So the very first step, do a right click in the start icon and go to task manager and maximize it. Once you have maximized it, at the very top, we have this processes and performance tab. We will talk about other tabs first later on. Now let's go to the performance tab and see how much is the CPU, memory, disk, and GPU. If it's below 50%, that means your CPU, the overall laptop or the desktop tower will not be heated because the usage is not very high and usage is actually directly proportional to the heat, just like the car and the bike. So more we race, higher the engine will you know, produce energy and it will get heated. So here, make sure all the CPU and memory disk and Wi-Fi GPU should not be very high, like 80%, 90%, 100% like that. Now, how we can make it lower? We will go to the startup tab, look which all applications are at the startup. So if any unnecessary, unwanted application is there at the startup, disable it by just doing a right click and disable. Now, please make sure you do not disable graphics, audio, security, or any other important tab. So you can see I have uh, very few services enabled, only five services enabled, and these are essential services. All right. Now we will go to the services tab, and here we will check, we will go to details first here. Now in details, look at the memory active private work. How, many, how much memory is using? So once you click on that twice, you will sort all the application, which application is using the highest resources. So if you see any unwanted, unknown thing, so you can try to disable it, but before disabling it, you can go to the services and check what exactly it is. You can also search online that what exactly that service is used for. And if it's a unwanted application, then just do a right click and click on run and here type appwiz.cpl all right and click on ok and this will open up the programs and features uninstall all unnecessary unknown unwanted applications once you do that you will actually remove the load from your pc and that is a good practice you should always check your program list how many applications have been installed that's a good thing now we will also move you need to check, are you, I mean, wherever your laptop is, does it has a vent, I mean, proper ventilation is there or not? The, it, it should be breathing and air should be passed from the overall room which you have. And please also make sure that the fan of your CPU and the RAM should be always running. If it's dirty, if it has dust, then remove it by professional. They will use some uh, you know blower to clean the a fan of that cpu that is very important all right and you can also add a extra case of fan i mean you, there are so many uh you know fans in the market where you can add a extra fan to your cpu especially for your desktop and in laptop please make sure the fan is running you can get it checked by the hardware specialist so these are the steps which you need to take and uh, definitely your computer will be in a better state. Now, there is a, uh, there are so many people who complain that while playing the game system gets heated. That means your, your game is using the whole computer resources. So if it's the case, then computer will be heated. It's a natural thing, just like the car and bike. So let's say if I'm, you know, um, taking the race and going at 100 kilometers per speed, definitely the, the power, I mean, the heat will be high. So please make sure that your computer should not be using more than 60, more than 50% uh, of the usage. For that, you can increase the RAM. You can change the graphics in your computer. 
All right, because there is no solution. Uh, if you have a low-end computer and you're trying to play a high-end game, which is using all the resources, and then you're complaining that your system is getting heated. So that's a natural thing. Same as car and bike, right? So I hope you have, uh, you know, understand what I'm trying to convey here and follow all these steps. And if you have liked this tutorial, please hit the like and subscribe. If you find this uh, tutorial helpful, leave a comment and let me know if this tutorial has helped you. I'll see you in the next video. Have a wonderful day.